What's up, you guys? This is another keyboard tutorial. This is Paris Hearns. Uh, like I said, uh, I have another tutorial for you guys today. It is by Eddie James called House of Prayer. It's an old song. Real simple song, like three chords and one alternate chord. Sometime this week, I am going to be um, showing you guys some more Eddie James older songs. Um, don't y'all sleep on Eddie James. He has a a lot of great worship songs, a lot of great upbeat songs, and I heard he had a new album that just came out, so I'm going to be also covering some of them songs, and I haven't forgot about you guys' songs that you have requested in the comments, so I'm going to be looking at them also, but let's get into it. This song is in the key of C, but you're barely even going to pay them. Well, yes, you are. Okay, so the song uh, goes something like this, Lord. Make me a house, make me a house of prayer, a house of prayer. That's the whole song. That's the that's the song, that's the chorus, that's the bridge, that's everything. So let me get each chord first. We go into A minor seven. This is C sharp major, C E G over A. Lord, make me a house. And all that you're doing, you're keeping the A in the bass. You're going to a G, a G major, G B D. Okay. So you're going from C major to a G. So, Lord, make me a house. Make me a house of prayer. This is F. F major. I always play the two. But that's um, F, um, A, C over F. And this time you just kind of hold it. Again, oh, A minor seven, make me a house. G over A, make me a house. Okay, and then the last time you go up to G. Prayer. Once you listen to the song, you know what I'm saying. The first time you go straight, A minor seven, G over A, F major. Hold it. Kind of, you know, do your little. Last time, I guess it depends on how many times you want to say that over and over. G over A. Okay, this time go up to G. A house of prayer. May the fire of my altar never burn out. The fire of my altar never burn out. I just kind of do the same thing, but I just, I go up to G, I know, walk it up back to the A, like, uh, it's a fire mountain, never burn, it's a fire mountain, never burn, it's a fire mountain, never burn, make me a house of G. So basically, it's going from A minus 7, G over A, L, uh, in the chorus, the same thing, you just walk it up G. A minor seven, that's the whole song, guys. Now, um, I did this a while ago. I do that a lot. Um, once you hit the A minor seven, and you hit the G over A, and then instead of going straight to F, I do this, which is C over E, really, uh, inverted. C major over E, which is um, E, G, C, then L. So instead of going, da, 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 I go, da, da, da. you know, after you do it over and over and over and over, you want to change that over. Or you can do it like that. Uh, Sometimes doing too much on sound, right? You just keep it like that. Invert a C over uh, E, G, walk it up. Now 
Now what I I say alternate chord is instead of doing the you know you go to A minor seven. Lord make me a house then G over A. Make me a house of prayer. Now what I can do instead of doing the G over A for the chorus I can just go A minor seven. Lord I mean man the fire my altar never burn. Then you hit the G chord. Okay, the original is G over A, but you know, you can go to the G, just G by itself. Just change it up, you know, talk to your choir director or if you the director, see how it sounds, you know, if she want to keep it the same with the G over A or the G, you know, kind of give it a different feel for the chorus and Whoever's in charge of the arranging the song, they may just want to keep it like that. But that's the whole gist of the song. Um, I told you it's going to be real simple, real easy. I think sometime this week I'm going to be doing some more Eddie Jane songs. Uh, I believe somebody told me his album just dropped. So, like, again, I got your comments. I'm working on them. And I'm also going to be a lot of albums. I think Tasha Carr album. Uh, uh, who else album? Eddie James, William McDowell. You got a lot of worship songs, so I'm going to try to get those worship songs. Travis Green album just dropped. A lot of albums just dropped. And you got to put in the comments. I don't, I, I try my best to keep up with who album dropped. Put in the comments of anybody album just dropped or a song that just dropped. But um, I thank you guys for retuning back in. Uh, for those who are just not noticing that I'm back putting up tutorials every Monday, keep me posted. I try to keep up with what's popping and what's on the radio. Um, let me know. Um, I'm here for you guys, you know. I just want to keep it simple and basic to get you started. And like I said, you can go from there on top of there and let God use you. But that's the main thing, letting go and letting God use you. No matter where you at, it doesn't matter if you play like uh, a, a maestro or not. Start where you at, let God use you where you at, and you can always elevate. You don't have to be in the same position your whole life. Start where you at, learn the basics, and just grow. Look on YouTube. Hopefully you guys have some mentors. Or be blessed to have people that you can ask and talk to. Uh, talk to me, you know. I don't have a lot. But what I do have, I, I don't mind sharing with you guys. So be blessed. Have a great week. Stay safe. Continue to trust in God. He will see you through, not just through music, but through life. Be blessed.